starting my seat. I'm late. I think I'm late. I don't know. I'm new to this. I always do my stuff with starts. So this is my first time doing them from seed. So I got me some seed mix. And I used some warm water. I had made some tea. So I poured warm water on my soil. And <laughs> I got my cups. So I've got... 12 different types of seeds. Um, I'm doing cayenne pepper, basil, California wonder pepper, chocolate pepper, Greek oregano, German chamomile, um, echinacea, lemon mint, Lemon balm, uh, holy basil, cracker jack marigolds. Those are so pretty to me. And stinging nettle. Now, I've got to have stinging nettle. Okay, let's try it. So, I'm supposed to put an inch. This is new to me. So, we're going we're gonna to see how big are the seeds. Microscopic. Okay. So it says this takes 10 to 14 days, and this is an inch. So we're going to go. What is this? <laughs> I made tags for them so I know what they are. So we're going to go see. I made tags. Let's see. We're going to do. I figure three. Look at how little they are though. Oh my gosh. It's like I can't even, I can't even pick them up. We're gonna, we're gonna try. All right. We're gonna see how that goes. Are so small. So we've done those Cracker Jack Marigolds. Did that tell me? Okay, hold on. Okay, it's the same. Apparently, they're all similar. I had scissors. We're gonna give it a go. I tried to grow marigolds last season. They didn't wanna do right. So I'm gonna try it out again this season. Because they didn't want to do what they needed to do. Okay. Holy basil. This is so wild. I wonder, like. So, this says 7 to 14 days to sprout. These herb seeds are super small. We're gonna see if we can do it. <laughs> okay. This is gonna sound like a really weird question, <laughs> but I already kind of wet the soil. Do I need to water them again? I think I do. I think so. I know that was a question. I'm just asking myself. Um, lemon balm. What I did learn is to put your 
tags in it when you do them. Because if not, you won't know what you planted. But I'm excited. Ah! Okay. How long do these take? 14 to 21 days before the lemon balm is ready. citrusy now I did have a question because I've seen people put saran wrap on top to kind of do this greenhouse effect so I don't know or if I could just leave them out and put them under the grow light we'll try it out I think I'm going to put saran wrap on it I think I'm going to do that I'm going to try it These are so small. <laughs> and then what do I have? Echinacea. These will all go in bigger pots as they grow and get bigger. Okay, now that's a bigger seed. I could get with it. How long does that take? 14 to 21 days to sprout. I can get with that. I can do that. Okay. What's next? Chamomile. That one doesn't have to go in deep. Why won't it open? <laughs> and they're small too. These seeds are so small. When I say small, I mean so small. So, so small. Okay. What else? Basil. We got a basil. How long does this one take? Okay, so it's 60 to 90 days for a harvest. So, this is 60 to 90 days. So, May, so that should be pretty good.
We're gonna try this, y'all. Cause I've never grown anything from seed, I promise you. Okay. Oregano. This is Greek oregano. Are they small too? God, these things are so small. <laughs> like, you don't even think that what comes out of these is what really is like this huge plant. You don't think it. You don't. Like something like super huge comes out of something super small. Okay, so I got the chocolate pepper. It's safe for bees. So it's seven to 14 days for germination. Okay, we're good to go on that one. Long red cayenne pepper. See what their seeds look like. Oh. It's like I heard a mailman. <laughs> I see that's what I'm used to pepper seeds looking like. Yeah. There's some more in here. I know there is. There's gotta be. Maybe there isn't. That was it. Okay. Glad they found a home. So I didn't have them. And then the last one is the California Wonder Pepper. I wonder how many are in here. If only four were in that one. It's more in this one than it was in that one. And there we go. We are good to go. Look at the babies. I don't want to drop them, but look at the babies. So I'm going to water them and put them under the saran wrap and put them on a heat mat. And that's what we're going to do. So let's go. We're going to try it. Now, I'm wondering if I put them on the heat mat and under the lamp or if I put them under the saran wrap. 
How will we do that? Let me think. I'll be back. Since I have a small space, I'm putting these right here in my kitchen next to my stove. <laughs> Shh, don't tell the plants. But I have a heat mat and I did get the grow light. So they can get some light. So that's where they're about to go. So this is their new home. So um, I'm going to water them and we're going to see how they do. This is my first time growing anything from seed. So wish me luck. But yeah, I am super excited about my seeds. So um, what is it? between 14 to 21 days. So we're gonna see how this goes. Cause they need eight hours of light from my understanding when I read it, they need at least eight hours of light. So we're gonna see. But yeah, but thanks for hanging out with me with my new plants, with my new seeds. Um, Hopefully they go well this year. I really hope they do well. I hope so. Y'all pray for my seedlings. Cause I want them to do well. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Have a good day.